transcranial magnetic stimulation or TMS is an approved treatment for major depressive disorder. And there's long been interest in TMS because it's linked to direct stimulation of the brain. Cole and colleagues examine some new ways to administer TMS that might increase its efficacy in patients with treatment resistant major depressive disorder. And there are two main messages to come out of this important new paper from Cole and colleagues. One is that the technique used in the study is called rapid theta burst stimulation, which allows physicians to administer higher doses of TMS over relatively short periods of time. And in this new randomized control trial, there's a suggestion that increasing the amount of stimulation that patients receive might in fact increase the efficacy of TMS for major depressive disorder. The second important finding is that Cole and colleagues tailor stimulation in this study based on the underlying pattern of brain function in each individual patient as measured by magnetic resonance imaging. And this suggests that by using what we know about brain function in individual patients, we might also be able to improve the efficacy of TMS. So this paper is important both because it's the state of the art of current basic science, but also because it suggests that this state of the art is becoming increasingly clinically relevant.